position to this screen. Okay, yeah, so we got Quizak versus Lilo. Going ready here in just a moment. Make sure everyone's in the right spot. They are not. Of course they aren't. Now they are. <laughs> All right, they you guys ready? Be, they could have switched mains. You uh, don't know. Yeah, you, that is, sounds like something they would do. Yeah, but, uh, <laughs> I mean, they do both play Kirby, as it says right there. You know? They both have played Kirby, yes. All right, we're just going to transition into it now. Again, two Sacramento players battling it out right now. See what happens here. I'm pretty sure in the rankings for Sac, Lalo usually wins against these guys, right? Usually, but you can't count Classic out. He does have wins over Lalo. And I think the last time they played... No, never mind. Yeah, Lalo smoked him. So. Yeah. But, you know, they, they play together all the time. They play friendlies. They play best of fives all the time. And it's kind of a coin flip, too. It's getting a good up tilt combo going right now. Actually, that made me stop playing the Falcon against his Kirby. He kept doing, doing three up tilt and then either a bear or yep. <laughs> he, he gets a lot of Falcon practice. Oh, my God. Gets spike. Gets a lot of Fox practice, too. So the good thing about... Actually, like it's bad that yeah, people who come together have to play together. But what's yeah. great is you get to see very familiarities in a matchup you probably don't see normally. What you often you hear from people. Bag over here? All right. <laughs> of course, they just bagged by the commentators. But yeah, two friends that play together all the time. They could be ranked widely apart, but they know each other so well. They so you can anticipate each other's moves. Right? It's like the weird opportunity where someone plays someone much yeah. higher than them because. Okay. All right. Well, I can go now if you if you don't mind. Oh, I'll commentate. We got Thank you. Welcome, welcome to Sacramento, everyone. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to do like. A, oh my God! I thought he was gonna do it to him again. You don't have to update the bracket as you want. Like you can just let it go like once right. or twice after game. Sure. But sure. Your scene choices are just. I got right you. Here. Uh oh. Oh, classic Edgeguard situation. Soft Nair sends him the wrong way. This is how you update the scoreboard. All right, I got you. I can, I can do that. Ah, my phone! All right, let's see what we can do against Ducks. All right, so yeah, just uh, it's just Trey Dozer here now commentating on these two. Qua oh, sorry, Lalo, great forward throw. Able to take out Kirby. Gets the first stock of the game for him, too. Now, Classic with the fresh stock. He's going to look for some kills, and he finds it right there. Great back air. Again, very good at anticipating Lalo's movements. And Classic has been on a little bit of a run this tournament. He's got some good wins. He winds up with the number three seed in his pool. He gets another back air. He finds a forward smash. Really punishing Lalo while he's coming on stage. And gets a soft back air. Now finds another forward smash. So good at covering his landing. And a reverse back air. I mean, if Lalo can't play... You know, Classic's just going to win. If you're off stage, you don't get to play. If you're getting comboed, you don't get to play. And now we get back to the neutral. Lala with a fresh stock, but no percent is safe against uh, Classic's Kirby. Doesn't do pivot up tilt very often, but he's, again, able to call out Fox's uh, movements. And now Quasic might be fishing for another forward smash. Pivot forward smash. This is kill move of choice. Almost gets it there, but gets stuffed by Lalo. Lalo down there. Finds the jab, but not able to get anything off of it. Able to throw him off stage and stuffing him in the face with laser after laser. Now Quasic, I think he's out of jumps. Yeah. Simple ledge hug for Lalo. Back in Sacramento, we call him Last Stock Lalo for a reason. It always seems to be the hardest one to take. Classic looks like he's just trying to get him off stage. Finds a down tilt. Both of these characters so patient around each other because they know what'll happen if one of them finds a hit. Now, 
Krasik doing some empty pivots, trying to trick Lalo into doing something to eat that would be uncharacteristic. And finds a forward smash. Lalo looking for a jab, but found Kirby's foot. And Krasik goes for a rising there. Could have just stayed on the ground. Lalo misses his up smash. Going to try and get a tech read. He gets a grab off of it. Find some more lasers into a soft back air. Kwasik now has to recover. Oh, but he's going to find more of Lalo's foot trying to do so. Kwasik, one strong back air, or nair even, from uh, setting up an edge guard situation. But if he finds that forward smash, this stock could be over. But Lalo gets a good combo, finds some decent percent. Kwasik needs to get back to stage. Oh, barely misses the forward smash. Tries to come back to stage again, able to get there. Very important for Kirby to get back to stage and land so that he can get those all those jumps back. Finds the forward smash, doesn't kill yet. I thought it was it. Lalo coming back. Oh, he finds a way to drift back to ledge. I thought Kwasik had him dead to right. Now finds another grab. So good at getting those grabs. That's a soft back air. Oh, but Kirby trying to get back to stage high. Can't do it. He's able to land. Kirby on the ground. Very difficult for Fox to deal with. That back air landed and sent him the other way. He could have tech chased that into the up smash. Classic. So good at dodging these lasers on the ground. Of course, all you have to do is stand there. Both of these guys know how important this next hit is. Nobody wants to do something that's unsafe. As the timer goes under two minutes. What? Oh, this is 64. Oh, and Lalo's with the up air. Finally ends the game at a minute and 30 left on the clock. Both of these guys feeling it after that. Lalo up. 1-0. See if Quasic can bring it back. And I think you're only going to see these two characters against each other. Quasic strictly uh, Kirby main. He's gone Pikachu a couple of times, but I don't think we're going to see it here. Both these guys, again, so patient, looking for that opening. Lalo really good at using the top flat to his advantage. Be able to get the Kirby off stage. Oh, and very good forward air into uh, forward smash for the Kirby. Oh, Lalo forward smashes the wrong way. And Kirby with the down tip goes for a reverse back air. Wasn't able to find it. Lalo shooting the gun, keeping Kirby grounded. If Kirby jumps, you're going to jump into the laser. Oh, tries to get the edge guard, can't find it. Gets back thrown, won't kill yet, but Kirby's got to get back to stage. Oh, he gets neutral air, that's all it takes. Once Kirby's exhausted all those jumps, his recovery is not particularly great, very linear. Lalo just throws out a down smash to catch Kirby moving. Oh, but Kirby finds the Nair. Uh-oh, gets grabbed, but yeah, I don't think the forward throw kills off the top flat just yet. Lalo with the recovery, but he's able to get to the top flat. Able to find his jabs. Up smash doesn't kill quite yet, but very close. Another jab might have done it. And now Quasic, all of his jumps exhausted. Oh, and he takes Lalo with him. He wanted to get back to stage, but just like game one, he's able to get the suicide kill. Oh, and he catches the up tilt. He's been looking for that all, all game. Almost gets another one there. Kirby finding a back air. And a dash attack, finds a grab, back throws for damage. 
Oh, he just missed that tickle tickle back air. The Lalo with the down tilt gets a little bit more damage. He finds a strong back air there. Damn my phone. Probably plugged in. Sorry. And what happened? Looks like Fox found a f up smash, and now Quasic has a lot of ground to make up here. He needs to get a kill immediately. But Lalo's Fox is so good at getting you and not letting go. Finds a Nair, but... Wow, what an escape by Quasic. Finds a forward smash, but hits a shield. He's fishing for those pivot forward smashes now. It's his kill move of choice. And now Lalo able to get a bunch of damage. I believe Kirby is in up smash kill percent now. Or he could just gimp him. Oh, he sends him the wrong way. Dash attack now. And that'll do it. Quasic has to play very patient, very safe. Because it's not going to take much for Lalo to kill him at this point. Both these characters playing so safe. But there's the up smash. Lalo going to take it. 2-0. Last stock Lalo on that last game really put in some work and never looks back going into game two. Get fucked, Quasic.